Hey guys, it's Shadow. Welcome back to the channel. I'm really excited to start the Mountain Royals DLC campaign. Let's begin with Tamar. You have me right where you want, Ogide Khan. After all of my unheard prayers, I now find myself kneeling before your bow. I should feel lucky to have survived this long, but the only thoughts that still cross my mind are of what could have been before the dreams of my kingdom were silenced by a rampage of butchery. It is cruel that you now ask me to humor you with a tale so captivating that you cannot loose your arrows into our chests. But for my own sake, and that of my advisors, I, Queen Rusudan of Georgia, will try. You Mongols look at my lavish garment and assume that we Georgians have never known hardship. But in truth, we come from beginnings as humble as any warlord without a battle to his name. Our kingdom sits at a crossroads between worlds, the Byzantine West and the Persianate East. For generations, we lived in the war-torn shadows of empires, competing on all sides of the mountains surrounding us. Under the leadership of my mother Tamar, however, Georgia would finally become an empire in its own right. Initially, Tamar was merely co-regent to her father, who hoped to ready his only child for when she inherited the throne. Turning to her great-grandfather, David the Builder, for inspiration, the young heir applied herself to the task, acquainting herself with every tedious detail that comes with ruling a kingdom. Yet, when her father died, she found herself cast into a political game for which nothing could have prepared her. Reeling from her father's authoritative reign, the Asnauri nobleman in her court deprived her of her powers before she could wield them. To achieve their ends, they forced her to marry a deposed Russian prince named Diuri, who vowed to keep her in check while the Asnauris continued to dilute the crown's authority. Facing resistance at every turn, Tamar had no choice but to travel to Armenia. There, she would seek the help of her only allies in the court, the brother Zakarian. All right, let's go and capture Yuri's monument then. Ah, sweet Armenia, it is a relief to see. Oh, good, a long intro. Indeed, Armenia is a pleasant place. So you can tell by those shabby buildings. Let us ride out to meet with my brother Zakari and finally put an end to these dark times. That's got a ruined church, that's kind of cool. I was to be married today, you know. I can only assume that the matter is urgent. The Asnauris have seized control of Georgia and wasted power in my ungrateful husband. Get you are. You two are the only people who can help me reclaim what is rightful. Take a look around you. Our churches are fortified for a reason. If you repair them, then your peasants may garrison inside for protection. Yeah. Oh, she's not a attacker, she's a healer. Not bring joy. That ends. My brother can heal your soldiers if they are ever injured. Obviously. I'm the better fighter. I forgot about these ones. They've actually got some conversions in, maybe. I'd get a bunch of. Oh, that's gonna have been taken. Oh. Feels so strange to be dropping off like this. If not, I've already tried it through the, uh, the preview. It feels strange. Let's see what happens when I 
Because usually there's something a bit more than just being able to use it. But he's also an uh, attacker. Why have you left our home? Do you really think those two fools can protect you from the Seljuks? I really just like not having any decent line of sight as you're using the uh, mule carts rather than actual. has not done a good job of protecting this castle. If you restore it, it is yours. It will not be long until the soldiers come to raid us. We must build defenses for when the dreaded hour comes. Or fight them like men, of course. <laughs> <laughs> yes, of course. Repairing this building has attracted villagers to work for you. <laughs> Get you ours. Get you ours. Get you ours. I get I really wish that she was able to convert as well as heal, or at least have some sort of attack with the heal, similar to the warrior monk Obviously, the Armenian unit, you know, not the uh, not the children one, but it's still a cool kind of attack, I think. I think a couple of these would be good as well, so we can increase our DPS a little bit. I didn't realize I had a scout over here as well. So much healing. And the thing with the repairing is it's trying to remind you that the repair is cheaper. Can I have it, please? Thank you, Get you, even necessary to win the mission, but feels sort of necessary. Uh, we're almost able to pick up to the castle age. Uh, probably... I actually don't know. Ah, damn it. I'm feeling just fine. Just let me lie down for a moment. You have done well repairing this castle. Hopefully, you are just as good at preserving it. That's handy. Hopefully, they do actually uh, send the guy back. Who with them? Not even two buildings. 
That seems kind of dumb. They're all white now. But try and attack. I'll try and convert, they'll just go. Uh... Alright, you won't get converted properly. Oh wow, it does not take any damage at all. I need the other guy back. It looks like this is a very slow pace initially. I thought this was like sucking really hard. That's just the nature of this mission. There's another one, right? Oh, there he is. They have no risk reside in these Georgian towns. If we depose them, I can assume my rightful place. I don't know how I feel about the um, voice acting here. Yeah. Because they've sort of tried to go for a more authentic. Accent, just like more similar to the region. It's kind of a little tricky to understand fully. Right, I will go for these. I think that's gonna be our best unit. Maybe another gold somewhere. Armashoni Belly, Zars, Armashoni Belly, I can't see what age these are in. This castle age then. Alright, try and do these now. Repairing this building has attracted villagers to work for it. That's nice that he's over to repair as well. Good work, he's taking a lot of damage. Oh. 
Button is uh, I don't have any units, I don't have any damage this year. It's not Imperial HS, so uh, I don't want to get too carried away on the religion house. That's annoying. Where did the villagers go? Did I lose them? Oh, they are there. Get you dispatch my Kuman Vanguard to investigate. My husband puts more trust in his foreign mercenaries than in me. If we subdue their leader, then they will waste the night. I'm better going to do that then. Repairing this building has attracted villagers to work for you. Come here. Might as well get that as well. There's already some towers that are up and running. Problem is, a small group of these lose a lot of uh, bites. My own men have squashed those petty raiders without breaking a sweat. I suggest that you return home before something bad happens. I know you're essentially meant to dislike a lot of the characters in the US. I thought like Garrison would be. My god, is he annoying. <laughs> Um, uh, can't make another castle. Are you kidding me? Oh, that's Ideally, we can Wait, I can't even go to uni. I'm also a little bit of a bad thing. I'm also a little bit of a bad thing. I'm also a little bit of a bad thing. I'm also a little bit of a bad thing. I'm also a this monk is not a chance. These human mercenaries are as fickle as one would expect. They will now serve us when the time comes. Alright. That ran research nice. This is Nuri. Oh, that's how we get extra costs. <laughs> There's any more. Once I've forgotten somewhere, might as well get that in some case. Get you ours, Zaz, Zanipt, Mighty Ours. 
I mean, just start deleting some villages. Okay, Lars. I don't even feel like I've ever boomed or anything here. Just don't need that many. Ah. Uh, just make sure I actually delete the freaking real cards. Wow. Get you Lars. Get I don't like the hard hitting low HP cavalry. It's, a, it's an interesting like last cannon sort of concept. Is there any point in making towers that I can't even operate online? Oh, that went down fast. I'm guessing the bot line is low. What is the difference to attack? Ah. Oh. And those beacon verts is annoying. Sistis has now re and get him out of my sight. And I wish that I was able to start getting more. Oh, can you pass it? Get you ours. I wish I was able to start. Get the in and I'm trying to get you to stay. That's not gonna last right on that. Those three will die. I guess we just come up to where we can right? Oh, it's gonna be such a speedrunnable mission in that case. I'm guessing, unless this is locked. Oh yeah, never mind, it's locked. <laughs> That's how they stop from me with speedrun. Please, you speedrun easily anyway. I could still probably do something like this with that. Okay, you just slowly pick away at it whilst. Oh, damn it, okay. The problem is a tower is absolutely nuking my cavalry here. We're trying to dodge some stuff here. While we try and rematch it all Should we find we just send the next group through? <laughs> Oh, well, well, I keep tomorrow alive, but I think she's gone. I'm hurt, but not dead. Carry on, man. I was attacking the walls anyway. All right, and then we should be able to defeat these three. I should not have taken that fight. Get Whoops. me back to safety so that I may rethink my strategy. Damn boyars, even though they have, I kind of just died of these because of their high and extra time. You, it is high time that we had a heart to heart. All right, let's up. We won the mission, I'm guessing, anyway. Did he? Raised by the Cumans following his father's murder, Yuri was skilled in combat. 
and a shrewd judge of character. It was not long before he earned the respect of the masses. The one person who vehemently disapproved of Yuri was Tamar herself, whose dysfunctional marriage left her in constant misery. When finally afforded the chance, she insisted that they be divorced. It was an unprecedented move for the already unprecedented queen, but for once she had her way, and she knew exactly who should replace Yuri. From a young age, Tamar's eyes had been for David Soslan, an Alanian prince who had frequented her palace ever since her aunt began looking after him. Tall in stature and built like a fortress, my father was the fancy of every maiden in Georgia. Most importantly, however, he respected Tamar in a way Yuri never had, preferring to submit to her orders rather than give his own. After so many setbacks, and with her former husband now exiled to Constantinople, the young queen could at last envision a future where she would take the lead. Opportunists lurk in the shadows of victory. Just as your father contended with a vengeful Kushnuk, my mother now faced the wrath of those blindsided by Yuri's Austin. One evening, Tamar invited the Asnauris to dinner, only to notice that her drink was not quite the usual color. When she caught the smug look on her guests' faces, she knew exactly who was at fault. Her suspicions were soon confirmed when Yuri returned from exile and seized the stronghold of Gori. Hungry to overthrow the woman who had disgraced him, the deposed leader now spearheaded a resistance of Wentful Asnauris and new followers who he had met while in exile. Having only recently seized power, Tamara now had to hold it. In a tense showdown, the two former partners would decide their future, or lack thereof. All right, so we're gonna try and get the achievement here. That's to defeat Yuri as well before the siege ends. Yes, I am back. Did you think that I would let another man take my rightful place? I should have realized a wreck like you would not give up so easily. That's a monument. My brother and I will hold the south. You just defense to Belize. The monument? What? Ah, uh, oh, that's the monument. Good boy. My guess here is the best way to do this is get your economy rolling really nicely and then kill everything with Monospa. I just got iconics. I am keep it alive if we can. Oh, they're already on the uh, Imperial Age then. Yuri's allies only support him because they think we are weak. Destroy their castles, and they will quickly bend the knee. Hit them to attack other things so that castles don't keep taking damage. Get you 
I wonder if there's a way of picking up to the Imperial Age. As always, the AI doesn't seem particularly competent. <laughs> I'm not sure that's really what I want it, to be honest. There's not that much there. And I restored order to Georgia. Yet you thanked me by stabbing me in the back. I will see that you have no home to return to. Taika. Law on the one very far. Trying to keep as much alive as possible. He's not exactly cheap to replace. And that way we can focus on building our death ball army. Damn it, that took forever to do. Zaars, don't be too far off being able to uh, just focus on military. Just need about 70 villagers and 40 or so farms. That is Yuri anyway. Must be somewhere on this road. Very nice. Don't even pass like the bridge anyway. He's from his prime places in range of the monastery to get the collection bonus. I wonder if we should destroy the Byzantine castle. I'm guessing one of the, knowing what these are like, one of these will give you access to him. The other one will do something else as well. I'm guessing it's just all, all around beneficial to destroy it. The problem is it's a Byzantine castle. I think they've got it slightly on the hill as well. One of my least favorite things about AO2. I mean, I guess it's also got murder hearts. Yeah, it's like murder hearts. It's like the trifecta of things that can make AO2 painful. Murder holes, kill castle. No imperial age. That's perfect for a quadrifactor. Get you ours. Either 
Get to us. That healing value, though. Oh, that was my only bold, though. It's only got all the safety on the watch of anyway. Maybe we'll try and get some siege together, see what we can do. Wow, those are some quick conversions, holy crap. I think this would be really useful. For the ally, just as if it got one towering for now. I don't care they could convert that, so I wasn't using it anyway. Oh my god, trying to kill this. Can I have more cataphracts in the Byzantine side of this, right? Oh, there's monks. Alright, send everything in. I don't even know if the children's got a timer, but it could be a good time to get a timer just because they're pissing me off. I had this amount of cavalry. Just gotta get that castle down. Pretty alright with a couple of rounds behind that. They will lose by the stuff here though in the process. That one was instant. The problem is when you break them off like this, they also do less damage. Uh, I'm something a bit cheap. Alright, I'll be down any second now. Alright, Jordan Rebels Castle's dead. Or Byzantines even. Their base now belongs to us. Get to us. Get to us. Get to us. From your past. I have to fight for mine. Why don't you give me access to Imperial Age? I have a feeling that just sieging this area without Imperial Age is going to be impossible. Or well, maybe Ivan's able to do something as a result. Alright, let's go and start taking this one out. Shouldn't take us too long. And we'll see if we can get to Imperial Age or not. Really hoping so. I think in the uh, Sven Tower that was kind of a waste in the end. Fun idea though. 
is that us? Uh, I'm going to send you guys over to here. Terribly. Keep you up here then for the moment. Only matters to do over there. Get you ours. No Vicom blood. I always forget how long it takes to get rams across the map. Are those are enemies. Kind of weird seeing uh, Yuri and M, and yet none of his units have any M upgrades whatsoever. Wrong to Sobia. Although that's what I might have faith on this way. Wait, was that heresy? Oh. Get you us. Go on. A little mine knocked down. Get you get you get you our token. Oh, okay. I went to wait on Garrison, it's like it, not risk losing him. Yeah. Oh crap. Uh -huh. That's a problem. Get you ours. That's funny actually, the fact that it treats the mule cart like a building for the purpose of that, so it traps the mule cart as one of its priorities. I kind of completely missed that though. I kind of forgot that. Did that a while ago as well. The treacherous Georgian rebels have forfeited their holdings. Get to our Get to our All right, now we just need to go and deal. Your resistance with this. crumbles before me. Let us finally put an end to our differences before all of Georgia is ruined. You take me for a fool. I never needed anyone's help. Damn, I shouldn't have done that without any help nearby. Didn't think they were gonna put so much into killing it. Or at least it delays them a little bit. I think it's mostly get rid of the siege underneath the castle. But yeah, it's gonna save it. Damn. That kind of sucks. I with barely a roof above my head following my father's murder. night of what I suffered through. Get to the bars. I'm not really sure why leaving you these side missions without like giving them a reason to do them. <laughs> I get redemption as an option to actually convert the buildings potentially. Although, if they start Imperial Age straight away, it's more than likely that they actually have. What's it called? Uh, heresy, and we should make this a waste of time. I think like the Imperial Age is a bit of a debate to be honest with you. Oh, it's still coming, it's taking so long. Finish that all. Look at this game trapped up for it at this point. Get you us. Get you out. Don't let me I'm trying to group them all together. Obviously, the castle will take back here. You just scout exactly where it is. 
You know, in retrospect, it would have been very cool, I think, to give the Bulgarians the fortified church. I need to give them the real car or anything. <laughs> if we get into actually trying to convert as well. Oh, that laughing Come on. <laughs> I have a feeling this cavalry is uh maybe a little bit too strong in against the AI. Purely because the AI has no idea what to do against it. Look at the AI buying food clubs. Never do such a crazy thing. I'm find out if there's another TC over here. I have a feeling that they'll resign once the other TC are down and the castle. Even ignoring the crepos. My daring feats made me George's most beloved man! Like the venom of a viper. <laughs> Freaking viper ruining Yuri's name. That's all I'm hearing here. I'll do another one. They're not very really satisfying in Castle H, to be honest with you. Uh, honestly, with how high the attack is, it's kind of fine. These are your rams. Not heading over here, though. Feeling that's gonna be next. Never mind. It is over again. Now my own will start in earnest. I have one mission actually. She. When Tamar's guards brought Yuri before the Queen, everyone in the room held their breath as she contemplated the fate of the men who had just brought her kingdom to the brink of collapse. As vengeful stares surrounded him, the once dauntless spirit suddenly broke down and burst into tears. Much like myself, you were looked into the face of death. But in that moment, something unexpected came over my mother, and she ordered her executioner to freeze his weapon before it could land. This act of mercy appalled many, yet Tamara stood firm. Such a ruthless demonstration, she said, was unworthy of a man who had battled her so valiantly, especially when only a stroke of luck had kept her from the same fate. Yuri was blessed with another chance. I can only pray that I am offered the same. Evidently, my story has not impressed you, and still you ask me for more. Perhaps you would not be teasing me with my advisor's corpse if I had chosen my words more carefully. Then again, regret was all but routine for my mother, whose responsibilities only continued to grow with time. If not for her new husband's support, 
she would have struggled to adapt to her newfound freedom. It was not long before the confidence that David installed in her proved crucial. The ruler of Shirvan, a Georgian protectorate, pled for her aid in his struggle for the city of Shamkor, which had just fallen to a Turkman army. Though largely unacquainted with her muslin vessel, Tamara knew that there was little time for detailed planning. She would need to act decisively while she still had an ally left to protect. Alright. Looks like there's a raise building salute resources type one. Let's go. These are the some of my favorite missions. On the horizon, but we must pillage the countryside before we can attack it. Oh, there's fish. Okay, that, that. Oh, oh. that's a bit cheeky having the relics already on the monks, and you don't see them by selecting the military. A lot of them in small groups at a time. Obviously, replacing an army is going to be difficult. But will support us with resources. Provided the Don't get your 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 the standard uh, sort of mission. <laughs> the economy and one of the more fixed forces scenarios. I'm liking it so far. <laughs> Oh, actually, yeah, quite a decent amount of food, though. This building holds resources. We must raise many more to supply our enemies. Uh, really, I have you going to hit and then. Shift food up to that. Damn, that was uh, quite a decent amount of food. I don't mean necessarily, so I need to also get to end some I have two dots, why am I only producing other ones? I think it's more important to get to a decent number of monarchs rather than go to Imperial Age because you can obviously generate a lot of. Resources by killing buildings. Therefore, replenishing the army is really important. We got a few of the set monsters for ourselves. Might just reassign a couple of these now. We got quite a few on food elsewhere. Get 
We're still playing the Okay. Are we at the point where I want to start clicking out? <laughs> we can get a possible defense, which is a massive buff. Get you up, 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 get you Lots of ways of generating resources. Get you up, 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 get you why am I trying to get conversions here? It's the unit size we can see. Get you ours. Get you ours. Do an extra relic or two would be nice. Looks like we do have the ability to make more hop space than we currently have. Good. That, that. Uh, ah. Oh goody. How much is elite? Kind of expensive. That in. Second trap. Get you ours. Martalhar. going to take forever to get over there. Oh, that's bad timing. Get you ours. Very, very bad timing. That's up. Get you ours. We have received tribute from Shilvan. It's us. Really not much, to be honest. Let's see if we can make them open. Alien. I don't know how much of a difference the elite version is. Imagining it's quite decent though. I know you seem to be pretty chill about me attacking the wall, it's unusual. Right, looks like that's the max pop space. Do another four or so of these. I'm worried about that as well, but I'm going to say Whoops. Alright, go ahead 
cut for me. We have captured a district oh. for Shivan. Get you ours. That was easy. What? <laughs> <laughs> that would be a lot more difficult. Get you ours. This one over as well. I think that's actually been a kind of a theme here. Like everything I've expected to be difficult has been a bit easier than I expected. That's good or bad for me. Oh, yeah, I've had some grits, but so slow. I thought I had expelled them. Get you fly. In the uh, Now, if you're gonna be an enemy or a friend, if I had to guess, I would say probably gonna be an enemy. A district for Shilvan. Get you ours. We have received tribute from Shilvan. Oh, nice. This is this mission has so much potential for a speed run. Get you ours. Not that I'm particularly good at speedrunning, but <laughs> this it definitely seems to be that. Now they put a relic there as if uh, most people are going to be able to get Get you get you get you are so irritating, they're not even a strong unit. They're just irritating. Alright, let's get the flag. Now its people will fight by our side. Ah. The Torcomans have promised to return my throne! Now you will finally learn to respect me. Even the bandits in the streets of Tbilisi have more scruples than me. Did you look at that? You're really against the You could have possibly seen that coming. Oh, Yuri! Ah, oh, so great of you to join us. Once we are rid of these Georgians, we shall celebrate. Okay, so these towers suck. Looks, like, looks like I can't even upgrade them either because uh, the allies ones as opposed to mine. Get you ours. Oh boy. Of course, they're allowed to come through there. Why wouldn't they be? Get oh, that's right. That would be really handy here. Yeah. 
Where's that villager? I lost him. Not a big fan of only having just a limited number of villagers and no way of replacing them that I can see just yet. I'm sorry to defeat Yuri as well. That shouldn't be too difficult though. I'm trying to send him through it. Holy hell. I mean, they are missing a lot of upgrades, but. We have received tribute from Shirvan. Get in I wonder if the Azanuri cavalry class versus Azanuri all times converts to the equivalent count. Ah! Our towers look so good. Just in general, I love this architecture to be Get your arse! 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 Get Get your arse! 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 Get it looks so cool. I really like kind of the unit. I really hope that we get more of these sort of like essentially regional reskins. It is still essentially a power in all of the ways that are important. There's another castle back there, good to know. Am I still getting cruisers to these blows? I think I am. Feels like a decrease amount, but I don't know. I'm also reinforcing from so far away. Oh, I don't even think I've seen any of yet and I did so much damage. Nineteen range trips? Nope. Come on, villager, repair in time. Please don't have to replace the interrupters here. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's enough for now anyway. So that will go down. There's just one TC to go. Oh, never mind, there's a castle over here as well. Of course there is. You insisted that I suffer the agony of failure. We have received tribute from Shirvan. Why, thank you, Shirvan. I need more than the one villager building castles, don't I? I build one over here. This is be the process of retraining a little bit.
problem is these things have very low, well, I mean, they're not very low PS, I don't like leap this level. They're still low enough. I do feel a little bit heavy grand for her. No, it's gonna see Trap the Mule Cut. Trap the Mule Cut. Good. One more castle down, and then there's this one town for the floor. Oh, I really need more food income. I might end up buying food here, though. Let's pick up some of the shortfall. Vivan's food economy has been underwhelming to say the least. That should be the final one of those though. And after that we can just focus on the other potatoes. Gotta be a little bit careful on the trade. Getting stuck. Alright, that should be Don't them out. Sakharans will resign soon. My riders come for you once more. I felt delayed. what remains of my realm. Oh, that increases damage on castles, right? Yeah. I'm thinking it's only for towers, but it's not. Feels like whenever a pop space is not going to be a particularly big issue. We have These are going to be insane. But when both players have like max pop, feels like he's going to be very, very weak by comparison. <laughs> Let's go from here next. Classic castle on a hill moment. Going through all those enemies might not be the best thing for a while. They're actually still training stuff. I thought that, that would be like a fixed forces scenario in terms of how they would work. Another <laughs> gold float though. I thought I went a little bit too light on the number of trade. Oh no, no, the horses. That's not necessary.
<laughs> getting past the face was a pretty sure sign that they're at Dan. Oh, they're destroying themselves? Cool. They must have got below the villager threshold. Even if you behave like a rabbit dog, I will not strike you down like one. Forget the crown, and I will let you live out your days in peace. Our enemies have surrendered, and Chilvan is restored. Victory is ours. On mission, though. <laughs> You may consider Tamar foolish for continually sparing her ungrateful former husband. But this steadfast kindness was her greatest quality. Despite suffering one betrayal after another, the queen remained remarkably composed. Many who once sought her demise now admired her integrity. Yuri, by contrast, now struck his former supporters as a desperate and delusional renegade. With his guise of righteousness shattered, all that remained was his vanity. Few mourned when he died in a Tbilisi monastery. Tamar, meanwhile, only grew more popular as she expanded her kingdom. For the queen treated her foreign subjects with dignity, rather than as lowly tributaries. Whenever the Turkmen's attacked, the people of Shirwan could always count on the queen's protection. Ruthlessness can be a powerful tool, but greater still is the strength to put it aside. Although peace reigned for a time, Tamar's recent victories had drawn the Rome Sultanate's ire. With war imminent, my mother thought back to David the Builder's defining moment. The Battle of Didgori was a watershed victory for Georgia, one which permanently established it as a force to be reckoned with. Outnumbered and outmaneuvered by the long invincible Seljuk forces, Tamar's great grandfather led his hardy Monaspas in a decisive shock charge. One which even the victors of Manziger could not withstand. Despite this, the Seljuks were only beaten, not vanquished. Now the haughty Sultan of Ram was eager to finally undo Didgori. He gleefully sent an emissary to Tamar, proposing that this feeble-minded woman marry him, or else be reduced to one of his concubines. When the ambassador delivered the letter to Tamar's court, and in rage, Zakaria smacked the emissary in the face, sending him to the floor. Undeterred by the Sultan's insults, the Queen wished to resolve the matter peacefully. But more pressing matters pulled her in another direction. Over the prior century, Armenia had fallen on hard times. Its key cities were now held by the Shadadis, whose yoke the Zakarian brothers were eager to overthrow. Liberating Armenia would gain Tamar and her husband a valuable ally in the inevitable conflict against the Seljuks. With the fate of Georgia once again at stake, the Queen would finally follow in her great-grandfather's footsteps. Alright, so we're going to try and do this mission. The achievement, which is uh, letting Alexio spill the wonder. Many so years ago, happening. my great grandfather David the Builder crushed the Ram Sultanate at the Battle of Ditgor. It is our destiny. Our enemies are well equipped. Tell us what to train, and we shall adjust our strategy accordingly. Bullswing cavalry archers pikemen while with <laughs> Armenian allies. Definitely gonna be archers and pikemen. Our armies shall counter all who stand in our path. <laughs> the Selchuk's pillage called with each raising. We must protect our buildings. Ooh. 
That is an interesting mechanic. It's like the inverse of a... The previous mission. Get all of the uh, eco The sun took out number our forces six to one. We will need to expand our sphere of influence before we can take the fight to them. Hopefully we can try and uh, work with the units and use that as a way of being able to get your cities early. They really want this freaking long. Holy crap. Forgive me, Tamar. I did not word that last message to you very thoroughly. Allow me to rephrase. Get my hand to you. You shall be the proud mother of future Sultans. Creep. Armashinebe. I have received urgent words from my nephew Alexius. Apparently, some reckless crusaders have chased him from Constantinople. He wishes to meet us near the walls of Trebizond to the west. Well, we need to try and get this first, I think. It's going to take forever. Please all over to here. It's kind of wild they want me to... And I know exactly where to look. Get you to destroy these town centers. With 4,800 HP. I wonder if ally buildings also count for that. Because that would make this mission significantly more difficult. In that case, we probably want to build a cast pretty soon near their base as well. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. I have a feeling. Get you ours. How do they suck this much though? I really want to finish that off. Well, oh, they're still in the feud, like. Yeah, allied raises count. Oh, that's bad. I wonder how many resources it is. It was similar to what I was gaining and losing. Actually, not a huge amount, but it does that out. We have liberated a city from the Shadanids. Now my brother and I can field larger armies. Good. Currently, you suck. I really want another one of these so I can increase the work rate. Around here as well. Oh, they just focus on building because they have that. 
Uh, that's cheeky. Zars. Ah, huh? what perfect timing. Say hello to my Saracen friends. Okay. So many sacks of gold at my disposal. Oh, these are imperial eggs. The shadows have occupied Armenia for far too long. Tell us where to go, my queen, and we will take vengeance on our enemies. Alright, we've actually got a bit of an eco going on. Double check if this is the max pop size. I think it might be one. Because if so, then we just stop making these. Let's get a few more bombs in now. Oh boy, that's bad. Come on, every time I try and go somewhere. AI is on me. It'll be fine. Buildings will be able to defend that. That is so that when they do start diving, the hours that we do have will be less crap. Get your arse. more on gold, but it's a good opportunity to do that. Get your arse. Get your arse. She might focus on him from then. Never have I been more glad to see my aunt. Help me take Trebizond, and you will have my eternal gratitude. Get you out of my Might as well. Get you out Get you out Get you out of the sooner we start that mission, the sooner we'll be able to complete the achievement. Get you out of Get you, get you, Also, there is more hot space to be had as well. I think I'm in castles over that direction, I should have done earlier. I just didn't realise that. That we're gonna suck this much. Well, I, I don't even have these in yet. Get your arse, don't get your arse. Get your get your arse, don't get your blood. Get your arse, don't get your arse. Get your arse. Alright. Once set this up, we've got to focus more of our attention. It's not that. <laughs> Now I am playing with power. I wish they had also repair their buildings. For such a braggart that Sultan is all business. Yeah, as we recover. Well, our economy is kind of lucky here. Get your arse. Get your arse. Get your arse. 
Get another trap. Probably not from here though, because that's the furthest one. Do not think for a moment that you will ride over us like your great grandfather David once did. Alright, with those castles in place, it should be a lot more difficult for them to take raises. It's a projectile there. I'm not sure why I've got villagers heading that way. I must have sent them there for some reason. Though. I really need to actually check what my problem is before going into these missions. I never do. And then I'm like, oh, what's my problem at? Like, could have figured that out if I had actually, you know, paid any attention. Then we're relying more on the defensive buildings than we are on. Discover at the moment, especially while we're waiting for the traps to actually arrive. That's, there is another one I can. Once that's arrived, then we can start actually getting stuff done. That in, why not? Husbandry. Where is Orange's pocket? Orange doesn't The problem with the fortified church is that it has a, um, no red garrison that has a different hockey than garrison that I usually use. Whatever I do there, it's a conflict. I get myself elite. Them at all costs. I mean, I feel like that's already pretty good protection. Don't right? kill me, kill Maybe send these down so we don't to live alone. I might get into it actually. Getting his new recovery from the is kind of a waste. Mm, there's gonna be another gold somewhere. Okay. He's full up and coming out of here. Uh, running low on wood is the worst at this point of the game because oh, I didn't realize we had a um. Chemistry. I also get rid of that as well once so I'm in the process of it because I can start hitting the town center. You know, we should um, make them open it. Come on, let me through. 
Man, I seem to be missing a bunch of upgrades. Maybe they were. Tribe is in the zone, your selections. I like killing the castle, that was maybe not the best. Let's have to hope that Alexios builds his wand of really freaking quick. My new home is not as fancy as Constantinople, but I shall build a palace here to suit an emperor. Help me defend my ass. laborers while they work tirelessly to complete it. Sand this, it's kind of not useful to me right now. Oh, we're gonna get that. Well, they're about to lose that, so that's worth more than the value of that, I think, anyway. Maybe the castle hits, to be honest. We have liberated a city from the Shadaritz. Now my brother and I can field larger armies. Zaras. No, not the full effect shot. I suggest that you find something fancy for your grand entrance into my capital. Get you ours. Oh, well, that wonder goes up fast. I'll just letting it to take a while. In which case, we'll do that. Get you ours. I don't know how. Oh, it's, it's actually. I thought that orange was in between me and green. We have apparently. liberated a city from the Shadaritz. Now my brother and I can field larger armies. Oh, that's bad timing. No! Uh -huh. The slowest quick pulls you've ever seen. And the worst part is that mule carts are count as well. Oh, it's probably Yellow's buildings as well, not like Yellow's on our line. That she has stuff. Well, at least they uh, make keeping my gold stuff is pretty good because uh, buying food still. Honestly, it's probably worth getting guilds just to do that. How about no? I think I'm just gonna, whenever I play we George, just end up with a bunch of random little parts everywhere. Now my brother and I can field larger armies.
Off that cast a lot. Uh, we might have to just run around with this. Whilst attempting to dodge. Deck does all. I hope that us enough time to get that up. Mine helpless. We have liberated a city from the Shadarids. Now my brother and I can feel blood around us. The Shadarids have been vanquished at last. Henceforth, the Zakarian brothers shall rule all of us. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must oh, we protect also them set up a dangerous tower area to blow them towards. I tire of your horsing around. Send something more exciting. What a magnificent sight. I hardly miss Constantinople now. Allow me to fight alongside you against the Seljuks. It's actually a really easy achievement to get. Although I feel like it'd be one of those ones that you can very easily miss if you aren't trying to get it. Carry on now. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. Oh, we release. oh wow, they went all the way back here. That wasn't meant to happen. I've been another mule cart, to be honest. I don't want to monk to heal these up. Unless we're gonna get from here or something. Yeah, it's from here. Saracens, but it doesn't seem worth too much. Oh, there's still not anywhere nearby. That's a castle. I wonder if I have another castle somewhere. Definitely have a TC over here. Another tower? Not even a bombard tower. Come on. What is this madness? Slamming turks with bombard towers. Maybe it's not in the right time. That's why they don't have them. No, if Constantinople's already fallen, then it should be the right time frame for it. Oh boy, I kind of get it for it, aren't I? Put them back to here. That castle, uh, that tram lasted about three seconds without help. <laughs> Let's 
We need castles and towers. I didn't know you could build castles and towers as well. I think we'll just build a castle on that though. I'm always build some more towers around. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. Where? Is it just that one heavy gun launcher? Welcome to AI. Oh boy. Oh, but when you number slate and lower these, they kind of really, really shit. <laughs> Try and kill these when we can. That's less than ideal. What building are they destroying now? Oh, it's these ones. Uh, that's a problem. I oh, also got these so many hassles here. Even though I've got them a whole bunch of extra freaking towns to go for. Let's go and deal with the traps, seeing as being a bit ill. That regard. These resources are yours, <laughs> Enemy raisins going crazy. Okay, so the Zakarian brothers really not helpful right now. <laughs> so the least. I'm just giving them a whole bunch of resources for free. I can't do anything to stop it, <laughs> other than have more military, which just isn't feasible right now, and then they'll come into my economy soon. France, I don't know how important it is, the amount of resources they're getting, if they're getting enough, or if they're... Holy, AI, can you please balance your economy? Another castle back there somewhere as well. I don't want to be able to destroy soon enough. Probably do with another four or five on food. Oh, I'm gonna take my drum. I'm to find my freaking meal cart. So annoying. Please actually get an army to defend themselves now.
Was a whole bunch of things back here. It was very useful to have. Get you ours. He goes to a marker. Try and see if there's any more idle military somewhere. I really like the uh, defensive buildings with the Georgians. They're just very satisfying to use. Like, they're not. Insanely strong. The oh, food price. We must protect them at all. That's just from the eye getting given a whole bunch of resources by the raisings and then not knowing how to balance this economy. I just use the market. That's also why they're still sort of in the game. Some extent or another. The Zakarian brothers are under attack. We must protect them at all costs. Oh my god, so many costs to get through. Zars. They're destroying now. Oh. What's this doing the way back here? Wow. So satisfying. Well, at least it's been that I haven't actually, haven't actually, actually uh, advanced my own economy in terms of getting more gold in at any point. Well, one of those why not? And that's all the stone that I have. Relatively easy access to. The cart crab here. The suit here. I wonder if they all get tribute when one of them is worth the building. Seems it might be that way. No, they're not really producing a whole lot. Another castle here down. Alright, looks like they're resigning. Excellent. They destroyed this one as well, no? Ooh. Please, just go away. I promise never to bother you again. That's I like it. <laughs> A glorious victory for Georgia. David the Builder would be proud. I'm actually really liking these missions. GG. Tomorrow's victory over the Selchuks earned Georgia immense prestige. Like David the Builder before her, she wasted no time in making the most of it. Tamar promoted educational reform and built new churches and hospitals throughout her ever-expanding domains. 
She worked tirelessly to improve the lives of the common people, whom the Asnauris had long ignored. From the humble soldier to the eloquent poet, Tamar cherished every loyal follower who had contributed to her success. She transformed Georgia from a small backwater kingdom into a flourishing empire, whose influence stretched from the shores of the Caspian Sea to the highlands of Anatolia. Truly, it was an inspiring time to grow up. In my youth, I never could have foreseen that this realm would one day be laid waste. Yet, as my mother knew all too well, even the happiest of moments can swiftly be soured. One night, an advisor arrived with a message that would forever haunt her. Your husband is dead. I was too distant from my father to be moved by his passing. But now, as I stare at the ghostly remains of my capital, I finally understand what my mother felt on that dreadful night. Even before the word spread, it was obvious that something had changed in the Queen. Only seldom would she show her face in public, and when she did, her manner was terse and indifferent. Misfortune followed swiftly. The resurgent Turkmen's devastated Zakata's capital of Ani, while Ivane was briefly imprisoned during one of his campaigns. Without David to soothe her, the widowed queen took to eating to cope with the stress. Doubt nodded her. Had she truly been this weak all along? Up until then, my mother had prevailed over sultans, emirs, and her own husband. Desperate to convince herself of something greater, she set her sight on a foe like none she had ever crossed. The Khwarazmsha, I assume, needs little introduction. Your armies have become quite familiar with his former domains by now. By challenging her most dangerous neighbor, Tamar put all of Georgia at risk. As her health took a turn for the worse, she knew that the next day was no guarantee. Before her time came, she would embark on one final test of her abilities. Only I remain now. What few words I have left to say may be my very last. No matter what follows, you shall know the whole truth. All right, slight costume change. Let's try and get this achievement. Get you out. Don't get you out. This is it. Either we achieve our greatest triumph, or we return on the brink of peril. We must secure supplies from Persian cities to strengthen our position. The Shah is gathering his army as we speak, so there is no time to lose. Try and keep as many of these initial units alive as possible. We don't really have a lot of resources to work with initially. The Turkoman city of Ardabil is nearby. We should crush what remains of them. Their hands are still bloody from the slaughter of my subjects in Ani. Okay, that's one now. All we go. We have pillaged resources from this Persian supply depot. Strangers, I pray that you have come to free us from the Shah's tyranny. Oh, well, I'm the one The entire kingdom is coward. Your Shah is Right. Keep losing a couple. Fine, you do kind of like start with being able to replace for this point. The Gorits were once mighty conquerors, but now they are the Shah's lackeys. We should burn down their fortress 
so that they cannot reinforce his army. Oh, what a relief it is to be rid of that horrid garrison. As long as you protect us, we will supply and house your army. Uh, so we're not going to deal with that just Go ahead. yet. Let those peasants feed your worthless cause. They'll be just as useless to you as they were to me. I'm going to use a trap to kill that rather than wasting any more time in this area. The AI doesn't seem to be too aggressive about defending this. Uh, I don't know if I have enough to take on that area yet. I think getting close to that the critical mass of CA. Let's we get that down. Well, they keep forgetting where all the stuff is. We have pillaged resources from this Persian supply depot. I'm getting a couple of these ready. Oh. Freaking heavy gambles. Where do they have villagers infinitely repairing? Well, there's all this hill terrain, so it's hard to uh, always get a good fight in this sort of area. Okay. Oh, what a relief it is to be rid of that horrid garrison. As long as you protect us, we will supply and house your army. <laughs> Gildson. Could be another one of them. Yeah, I'm here. This trading outpost links to the fabled Silk Road. We should capture it and seize the shark's gold. He's damned, uh, poor elephant's a problem. Zars. Do I have to kill the towers as well? If so, I'll just send the trap down here. And just fish it up slowly. The trap doesn't really have any other use for a while. Just a bit dip to finish it off, that's fine. We have pillage resources from this Persian supply depot. Uh, I think three was enough. I think this last. Just enough to take a not so terrible fight. Please, just take these buildings. I have no one left to protect me. I'm glad we found that. Out. 
Send these over to here. Probably time to start making Monospa over. I'm not sure. I'm also what the direction I want to walk in a while. Oh, whoops, I thought I'd put the board on the bus. <laughs> they absolutely destroyed everything. That's right. That's switching over primarily to the last one. As long as you protect us, we will supply and house your army. Please, just take these buildings. I have no one left to protect me. We have pillage resources from this Persian supply depot. All right, and then this one can start hitting this one. This is trading post capture. The Silk Road will now supply us, and not the Shah. And this one can also get that before we start sending them back down. Zaas. Uh. Yeah. Then she's off for now and then go back down. Get you out! Get you out! Get you out! Get I'm gonna distract them with a couple of rounds. We have pillage resources from this Persian supply depot. Alright, to this one. Get you out! And this village is almost done. Rasak for Zanet. He was Trey Marjo. I can't even get access to Siege Ram if I want. And obviously I've won, but... Get you Try and get these going. Oh, what a relief it is to be rid of that horrid actually. garrison. As long as you protect us, we will supply and house your army. Start off with this. Get you lost. I'm such a in this. Surrounded by it. It's a 
Our chemistry takes a long time. We have pivot resources from this Persian supply depot. I'm raising those a little one forward, that's fine. Alright, so we got them distracted over there. Are we missing anything? I think that's all of them. I wish that I was at the bottom of it soon enough. Get you out of here, I don't actually need to add any more units than I've already got. Oh, I think we'll just use the rest of these resources for other things. That might make things a bit easier in the uh, next section. Oh, not the gives you a fiery test. Not maybe I don't think it's ours. That's better than sitting on a bunch of resources that we actually cannot use. Those over here just in case it's something I missed over here. Select your relic. You know, it'd actually be probably good to get them. No, all the stuff changes. Without their fortress, the courts will not be able to muster as many soldiers. We have done everything that we can. The Shah's army will be here soon. Let us join the rest of our forces. Carrying all of this loot back to Georgia will require many men. If you wish to spend it all immediately, there are many on wing of our army we will have to stay behind. We'll definitely the soldiers are too well able to leave behind. We will bring the rest of the loot home later. Okay. Last time. There was big issues on this thing initially because we just did not have really enough production. Like. I'm sorry, do anything good yet. Yeah. And the monks are really pivotal in its initial fight. Get you, Lars. Looks like we've got all of our upgrades that we need. I don't think we need to actually add any additional blows. Yeah, we actually um, already completed this mission up at this point. We won all of the battles and everything. That was just a little bit too slow. On the Gorids Fortress. Literally seconds. Much difference would have actually got me to have the mission done. We stand together at this moment. Fight bravely in the name of Georgia. Like having 
flaming camels always. Oh, just listen to my elephants. And they thunder across the field. They sound the tune to my victory march. Just in case. Sorry, Mom. <laughs> ah, the box absolutely destroyed her. Even more than last time. Charge my monasteries. Unleash the power of Georgie. Rasal Pilamit, Shem Grave, Zatio Martal Hut. Terribly. Rasal Pilamit. I feel like we're very lucky in gold right now. <laughs> siege Elephant versus the not so Siege Elephant. Alright, let's get all of our army kind of organized. Forward men! For Queen Tamar! This is an impossible army to actually micro. I'm uh, still going after that, apparently. That's what I was talking about eggs ago. Oh, boy. I think a few of these wouldn't be the worst in the world. Highly, highly recommend banging mobs in this one. Kind of impossible to do comfortably like without, I think. There's a decent amount of gold coming in. I'm not even realize how long crab steaks to produce. Also, are impacted by the Azmir cavalry today. Oh, I did not just oh, okay. do that for very long. Did I lose some monks somewhere? I think I did. Fine. They already got me a heap of value. We're like another four divide one to start forward, maybe. Especially with those relics in. It all kind of falls apart once you start hitting the train anyway. They seem to have a pretty big stockpile of a lot of other things, but they don't seem to have a massive stockpile of gold. Oh, this is still here. <laughs> yeah. 
honestly think that what ends up happening in these sorts of missions is the elephants end up causing their opponents more issues. They cause you to try and see if you work on the as well while we're at it. Probably won't get away with it, but. Busy enough, getting rid of Yellow's castles early doesn't benefit me that much because I'm just using things against them in the end. I'm just gonna go down right soon. Even the fortified church of the two relics still help to clear things up a bit as well. Especially when I can kill those castles fast and very, very My partner is weakling! I will slay any deserters with my own sword! Oh, I'm still taking that goal. I really like these, um, minaret, or how you say it, buildings in it. It looks really cool. So you may notice that the Monospar are absolutely annihilating buildings here. They're currently got a very unusual bug. They do way more damage than they're meant to do based on their bonus damage mechanic. Get rid of that one. That castle won't last very long at all. You can see that just how quickly they tear through buildings. Bad day to be a villain though. I think if you micro your really, really annoying crabs, almost always they'll do exactly what you want when you want. But unless you do that, they will never do what you need them to do. <laughs> Warrior Freeze looks so cool. Still feel kind of weird about it being the odd means to get the Warrior Freeze. Our enemies are breaking. We have almost prevailed, my queen. Actually, send these over to finish it off, maybe. With a bit of help with the poor elephant. The lack of bonus damage these will be getting against them, and the fact they have architecture in might take a little bit, especially with the trees also around there as well. <laughs> and find fun stuff to do with these whilst we're waiting. Whoa. Did they a leader or did these absolutely no, they must have leaded it. The Shah's army is 
the kingdom of Georgia shall immortalize your name. <laughs> My body fails me with every passing moment. Oh no. Bring me home to be our beautiful kingdom and final fairy. Is it? Have I finally evoked something in you? Is it your respect for my mother's victory against the Shah, the man whose defeat was the crowning jewel of your father's achievements that makes you spare my life? Is that why you offer me the bow that moments ago was to kill me? For all the atrocities that you have wrought, it would be perverse of me to accept it. And yet, I will. My mother brought Georgia to heights previously unthinkable. She contended with the greats of her time and bested them all. She left behind a magnificent legacy. But for all my efforts, I have failed to preserve it. I'm not worthy of Tamar the Great, nor have I ever been. If submitting to your rule will save what is left of her kingdom, then I will accept your friendship. In return, I plead only that you accept this. Inscribed is a story of valor, adversity, and companionship. The knight in the panther's skin is a tale inspired by my mother's life, one which raises our spirits to this day. When generations have passed, these stories will be all that we leave behind. Your father may well be renowned as the greatest conqueror of all time, whilst my mother becomes just another one of history's forgotten. However the next thousand years look back on us, may our fates be bound evermore. Well that does it for the Tamar campaign. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you again soon with the next one.